Hey guys, it's Phone Arena, and right now we're just going to show you a hands-on look at HDR photos on the iPhone 4, which is part of the iOS 4.1 update released a few days ago. And if you haven't heard about it, they're basically called high dynamic range photos. Um, there are basically three different images combined, which are basically uh, one that's overexposed, one that's underexposed, and the regular shot, all three are combined to produce HDR photos. So let's just quickly show you what how, how to take one and what uh, kind of um, detail they produce. So I just launched the uh, camera application here, and once you have it up, uh, you'll, you'll instantly recognize right away whether or not you're taking HDR photos or not. It'll indicate it right there. If you want to turn it off, you have the ability to do it. Now the neat thing is when you take HDR photos, it's going to save the original image and also the one in HDR format. So let's just take a quick uh, photo here of this, of this uh, image. It does take a little bit longer to save the uh, photos in HDR just because it's processing everything. If we go to the gallery app here, let's just uh, compare uh, the two images here. So this one here is in HDR, as you could indicate right here on the top left. If I swipe over, it's going to show me the original image here. Now, as you can tell, colors are a little bit, a little bit saturated looking on the original image, while on in HDR they're a little bit lighter, um, a little bit overexposed, as some of us would say. Um, so there are some other examples here that I'll show you. And you can tell definitely, here's a perfect one here. This one here is in HDR format. There's a lot more detail when you zoom in, which does a great job of showing every fine detail with the image. With the regular shot though, the color is a little bit more saturated looking, but the detail is kind of a little bit lost compared to the other one. Another example here is in outdoor conditions, for example, the grass. Um, here in this HDR image, you could see that you could tell that the grass is a little bit lighter in color versus the original one here. It's a little, a little bit more natural looking. So it's just going to depend on what um, which one you're going to like. Uh, in, cer in certain conditions, it's going to be a little bit better. Others, it might look a little bit washed out or a little bit overexposed. You could tell here the difference between the two. You have one that's the normal shot, which produces some really good colors. Uh, while the one HDR, it's definitely a lot lighter in tones. But as we showed you before, it did produce a lot, a little bit better detail in uh, some some conditions. So if you'd like to check out more of the uh, samples we have on our site at phonerun.com, and you can even check it out and see for yourself whether or not it's uh, definitely an improvement versus uh, taking it uh, for standard photos.